The joinery tool of the back allows me to open any downloaded or self-created component saved in my personal library. The components open using the joinery tool of the back will interact with the wall and will create a trim. Therefore, this joinery tool is perfect to insert any doors, windows or lattice work saved in my computer. The selected joinery will also have a 2D representation and similar insertion methods as the default joinery of the back. In this case, I press the tab key to change the insertion point to the center. This way, I can place the joinery in this wall and if I press Ctrl key when it's pink, the component will be inserted in the center of the wall. Now I'm going to choose a lattice component in my folder to work as a joinery in the wall of the terrace. For this, I have to double click on the group of the terrace to get into edition mode and open the lattice component using the choose joinery tool of the back. Now I can easily insert it in this section of the wall. I'm going to convert the floor plan to 3D to see how it looks like. After a few seconds, I can check that the sliding door of the bathroom is nicely inserted, however the lattice is a little bit above the height of the terrace wall. I actually have two ways to fix this. One of them is to convert this group back to 2D, double click to get into edition mode, and replace this joinery with the same one, but setting a different elevation. The other method is to convert the model to 3D, double click to get into edition mode, and move this lattice joinery using the move tool and forcing with the respective axis. So it's very important to force in the X, Y or Z axis to move it along the wall. Now I can activate the X-Rays mode to make several copies of my lattice joinery. I can grab it from this corner and take it to this corner. After confirming the first copy, I can type X6 to repeat this action six times. I can select all the joineries and, and move them all together along the wall. Now I can disable the X-Rays mode if I want to and convert to 2D to see that the position of the joineries have been updated both in 2D and also in 3D.